Hello guys, just made this soldering iron tip, thought I'd show everybody. I got tired of uh, buying Weller tips, they don't last, they just uh, burn up real easy. It's a Weller WPS18MP, so it's a, it's a nice soldering gun. I mean it's low voltage about 9 volts and uh, so I made this tip it's all one piece except for the uh, copper tip on the end and uh, where the black is there's two pieces in there but uh, let me show you what happens on these tips is that the very tip of the copper burns up and then it shorts out. Uh, what I did was uh, drilled all these little spot welds around this tube here and then I separated this tube, I pulled this tube off of this. So that released the uh, point connection and actually brought the element and everything out or actually it broke the wires pulling it out but uh, so what I did I took some stainless steel uh, stainless steel rod and turned it on the lathe made this exact shape and so in essence I copied this exact dimensions but made it longer So as you can see right there, made it longer, drilled the center of it all the way up almost to the end of the met piece of metal or stainless steel. And then uh, the outside of it I threaded to accept these tips. I've had these for many years, but uh, I can make these tips as well out of copper or brass. So yeah the tips are cheap but I got tired of buying them online by the time you pay shipping and everything you got 15 bucks invested in it and I was tired of them wearing out so quick so I made the element to go inside and I used a uh, brass rod threaded wrapped the eight and a half inch, eight and a half inches of uh, number 31 nichrome wire that's insulated and then I took uh, and wrapped that used the eight and a half inches and then I crimped it with uh, Teflon coated wire with these little crimps here and I just cut part of it off and then crimped the rest to make the splice on each end of the eight and a half inch long nichrome wire once I did that then I wrapped it and connected the uh, Teflon wire to the solder joints on the uh, pin connector and then press the thing all back together put it together and uh, plugged it in and screwed the tip on it it works worked great as you can see hot enough to, to melt it and uh, I don't think I'll be burning up tips and the element will last for a very long time one of my other videos I make uh, elements for the 3D printer the print bed and you can view how I make those with the nichrome wire I did the this element in the exact same way so hope you enjoyed this